the house of the Lord, the first Sunday of the year. So I welcome each one of you. As we begin this year, I want us, uh, I'm going to read Psalm 23. If you have your Bibles, open it and let's read it together. And this will be our guide throughout 2021. We don't know what is ahead, but we know who we trust in. Yeah. Who will take us through this year. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. So can you stand and turn to Psalm 23 as we read it together. This one. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside the still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in the paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Yea, do I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Verse 6 again. Let's read verse 6 again. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. So it's in spite of what 2021 brings to, us, brings to us, we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And even if the church is closed, we could still dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Our communion was always with me with the Lord. Hallelujah. Let's give him a praise this morning. Hallelujah. 2021. We dedicate our lives to him this morning. Hallelujah.
morning, Father God. You alone are worthy. You alone are holy. You alone are awesome. Father God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. You bless the name, Father God. God sent the Son. They call him Jesus. Hallelujah. Him who died for us on the cross of Calvary. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. 